Hey what's up I'm Nizio Cole and recently there has been some news surrounding Watch Dogs Legion, which is surprising considering Ubisoft abandoned the game just about a year ago. But this is a primarily Watch Dogs YouTube channel so I'm going to be talking about all of that today. So I actually believe it was a few months ago, either it was leaks or rumors or they announced it, that Watch Dogs Legion would be coming to Steam. I'm not sure if it's just Watch Dogs Legion or if there are some other Ubisoft games, but we have the Steam page for Watch Dogs Legion and you can see it, you can search it up, you can see it comes out on January 26th. Originally earlier today it did say January 24th but I guess they pushed it back which you know, typical Ubisoft fashion. Now this is actually really exciting to me because I've actually wanted this for a very long time. If you don't know, Steam is my primary platform to play games, so anytime I have to go off of Steam to Epic or Uplay or, or whatever, or GOG, well GOG is actually pretty good, but you get the point, I don't like going off of Steam, so having it on Steam now will be pretty cool. Before what I would do is I would just add it as a non-Steam game, but it would launch the Uplay executable. So it's honestly really cool that it's finally coming to Steam, it should have came to Steam on October 29th. 2020, but you live and learn. Although I don't think this is kind of a goodwill moment for Ubisoft, as we'll get into in a second. It's really bittersweet because it's like, it's like a slap in the face almost. You know, they abandon the game, just drop it, no updates, leave a bunch of bugs in the game, just completely lie to us, don't even add features that they promised that they were going to add, and then a year later, they're like, oh yeah, by the way, it's on Steam now. I mean, it ends up feeling really, really cheap, and it sucks because this is one of my favorite franchises in all of gaming, and Ubisoft has just squandered it. And I mean, it feels like in general, Ubisoft has been dropping in quality over the past few years. Apparently, I haven't looked too deep into this, so you guys can do your own research, but apparently they're like low on money, and they canceled a bunch of games, one which was a potential Watch Dogs 4, allegedly, and they delayed a few other games. Or something like that. Again, I haven't looked into this too deep, and apparently there's some Ubisoft employees trying to go on strike, so that company is just like in complete chaos right now. It's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy to see this happen to such a giant in the gaming industry. Oh, also apparently it uses Denuvo now, which uh, I, I think I've talked about a few times on this channel, but I I'm not the biggest fan of Denuvo. Anti-cheats in general, especially on single player games. Yes, Watch Dogs Legion has multiplayer. You can do anti-cheat in multiplayer, but single player is, is just, yeah, I'm not a fan of that. Also on the store page, it's kind of weird. They flex the TU 5.5 update as if that update wasn't released over a year ago. And also something I thought was funny on the Steam page, it says this game is similar to Rust, which I have no idea how, but yeah, that's pretty much all I had to talk about as far as this whole Watch Dogs Legion coming to Steam, Ubisoft drama. Let me know what your thoughts on all of this are down in the comment section below, and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.